potentially sweat. It also kind of help us understand why this is so relevant to what we're seeing in the Dota 2 community and kind of the way things are moving forward in technology. I mean, this is a really interesting perspective to have here while the international is happening in the background. Uh, absolutely. I think I've seen that clip like at least a hundred times. It's, it's legendary. You know, the whole venue was just echoing. It was just, you know, really easy to root for, you know, our, you know, fellow countrymen. That was a great part of Dota history, the meme-making game, Liquid versus LGD. Best of one, loser eliminated, winner in the top eight. The draft complete, the players now selecting their heroes, and here we go. Team USA is having the home crowd behind them. I think going into that match, I don't think Liquid really, you know, liked their odds very much. They were just gonna leave it all out in the field, and you know, it was enough. LGD was, you know, a top dog in that tournament, and you know, they were, you know, predicted to win. And it's gonna be a Bulba clockwork yeah. making a comeback here. Bulba still doing pretty well mid. I actually would say it's very even. I remember Bulba. He was really, really performing on his clockwork, making. Some insane place. Against LGD China. Could there be a turnaround? It was like my first ever like tournament. This was like a big moment for me because I wanted to prove myself. This game was everything for us. We need a hook. Boba finds one. That's gonna be on Xiaowei. And I was getting all these kills with with clockwork. He just killed Xiaowei when he was split pushing a three on. And then finally there was a big team fight in their base and I had a really good hook on like two people. At that point I couldn't really hold it anymore. I just started like getting up and my seat even though the game wasn't over. And now I'll look back and say, wow, what, what was I doing? I used to have a soundboard. My number one most clicked one was the LD part when Liquid, they won. I think it goes like this. Siler to fall, Liquid are doing it. Siler to fall, Liquid are doing it. And Bava is on his feet. <laughs> I believe that's how it goes, but it's so, it's so epic. You know, everyone loves an underdog and being able to cheer for you know, the home crowd favorite and getting behind them and all these personalities on the team, especially Sam, like it's, it's an easy personality to cheer for. He's just, you know, a kid who wants to do well at his first big tournament and, you know, take it home to his family and his parents. And I imagine he was just totally overwhelmed and full of energy and excitement and soaking in the crowd was his way of releasing that emotion. I think the fans loved it, you know. The crowd was going pretty crazy because it was the first time an American team had ever done anything, so that was pretty cool. Before that, the American scene was very, very bad. North American Dota. <laughs> yeah, I, I, uh... It was cool to see that everyone can beat everyone in tournaments like this, so everyone have a chance to win tournament. I like to think that game will be remembered as a turning point and it proves that anyone can really do it.